meet the man who received the first penis transplant in the U.S. It's official, penis transplants are now within the realm of possibility. This week, a team of doctors from Massachusetts General Hospital in Boston performed the first penis transplant in the United States, the New York Times reports. The recipient of the new appendage is Thomas Manning, a 64-year-old man from Massachusetts who lost his penis to cancer. His new member came from a deceased donor medical miracle that might make you feel both awestruck and slightly squeamish. The 15-hour operation was led by a plastic and reconstructive surgeon, and the doctors are anxiously optimistic about the function and success of the penis over time, according to the New York Times. Docs say the newly reappropriated peen should be fully functional then for frisky time. This is the third penis transplant to be performed worldwide. An unsuccessful attempt was made in China in 2006, and a successful transplant was made in South Africa in 2014, the New York Times reports. The recipient of a successful transplant has even reportedly fathered a child since his groundbreaking to surgery. The push for penile transplants in the U.S. is largely geared towards veterans who have suffered severe pelvic injuries in combat, as well as cancer survivors like Manning. There are currently two other patients on the waitlist for penile transplants at MassGen. But the odds that we'll see men swapping out their schlongs for purely aesthetic purposes remains highly unlikely.